Hello everyone, in this video we are going to solve class 6 math chapter 7 fractions exercise 7.3 question 1. So question 1 says write the fractions and second part of the question is are all these fractions equivalent fractions. It is having two parts A and B. So let's start with our A part. A part we have been given four circles and we have to first write the fractions for these pictures after writing the fractions, we have to tell whether these fractions are equivalent or not. So we will be writing fractions as numerator divided by denominator. And in the numerator, we will be writing the shaded parts. Number for shaded parts. And divided by in the denominator, we will write the total number of parts of the picture. So here in the first picture, we have the circle. And it is divided into two parts. So total parts will be two and one part is shaded. So we are going to write one in the numerator. So the fraction for first circle is one by two. The second circle is having four parts. One, two, three, four. So denominator will be four. And out of four, two parts are shaded. So the fraction is two by four, which can be reduced to one by two. 2 times 1 and 2 times 2. So we can write 2 by 4 as 1 by 2. We have to always make a practice of writing fractions in simplest form. Next one is the circle having 6 equal parts. And out of 6, 3 parts are shaded. So 3 by 6 will be the fraction which we can write in simplest form as 1 by 2. The last circle is having 8 equal parts and out of 8 parts, 4 are shaded. So the fraction is 4 by 8 which can be reduced or written in simplest form as 1 by 2. So now we see that all the fractions have been written and all the fractions in simplest form are equal. The answer for the next part is as all the fractions are equal, so the fractions are equivalent fractions. This completes our A part of the question. Let's move on to the B part. In B part 2, we have been given few pictures. In these pictures, blue dots will be considered as the shaded part. So our numerator will be blue dots. And denominator will be total number of dots. Let's count the number of dots for the first picture. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So total number of dots is 12 out of which 4 dots are blue dots. So the fraction is 4 by 12. 4 by 12 can be reduced to 1 by 3. 4 times 1 and 4 times 3. Let's write the fraction for the next one. The next one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Total number of dots is 9 dots out of which 3 dots are blue dots. So the fraction is reduced to 1 by 3. In the next picture we have 6 dots in total and out of which 2 are blue dots. Fraction is 2 by 6 which is reduced to 1 by 3. Fourth one is there are 3 dots out of which 1 is blue. So the fraction is 1 by 3. In the last picture we have total number of 15 dots out of which 6 are blue dots. So 6 by 15 is reduced to 3 times 2 and 3 times 5 is reduced to 2 by 5. We have written fractions for all the pictures. Now we see that out of these 5 fractions only 4 fractions are equal. The last one is not equal. Hence the fractions are not equivalent fractions. So we are Going to write the answer for the second part as, as all the fractions are not equal. So, the fractions are not equivalent fractions. This completes question 1 of exercise 7.3. I hope now you have understood how to write fractions for different pictures. And this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.